Okay, today I just want to give a brief uh, description and show uh, what voltage drop looks like uh, in a charging circuit uh, on a Westerby engine. This happens to be the factory charging circuit. The output from the alternator runs directly over to the starter post and picks up the larger wire and goes back to the battery switch. But um, what we have here is a scenario where the alternator is in voltage limiting mode. Uh, it's in absorption according to the alternator. And it's seeing right about 14.4 um, roughly volts. This is a very fast meter, so it's capturing those changes that the voltage regulator is trying to maintain the voltage. We're only pumping out about 10 amps of charge current. And you can see the very small wire. It's about a 12 gauge wire and up here on this meter we've got the voltage at the batteries which is horrible. This is over a volt or roughly one volt of voltage drop between the back of the alternator and the batteries and this battery will never get to 14.4 volts because the alternator is already there. It's limiting itself in voltage right now and uh, these batteries are chronically under charge. They didn't last very long. They won't last very long. Uh, and as you can see, I'm, I'm uh, measuring the voltage of just one of the batteries right now. Uh, so 13.3 uh, at the batteries, but 14.4 um, at the alternator, which is 10 inch charge for Not a good situation. I'll correct that today by running a, a better ground to the alternator and a, a, a larger positive wire.